Hey, Hail Force, and welcome back to Let's Play Shining Force CD. We are entering Chapter 3. And they began to panic because their attempts to control the ship failed. Uh, yes, as you'll recall, we entered trap. Namely, a ship. That's remote controlled. Oh, jeez, voices. <laughs> what are we going to do? We need to take control of this ship. If Natasha was here, she could help us. Mm -hmm. uh, I wonder where they are. Instead of worrying about the others, we should be thinking of ourselves. Perhaps this is one of Iam's traps. If so, we're in trouble. And she really wants to steer, steer this thing, I guess. We must stop this ship! It's futile. Oh, hi. You fools. You guessed correctly. This is a trap to separate you from your friends in Portobello. Yeah, well, you didn't get all of us, which may or may not serve you, but we'll see. That looks a little bit like the uh, battle right before uh, Zalberg in Channel Force 2. It's too late for you. I don't know about too late. So we are just the six of us. Jaha, Diana, May, and... Okay. I don't have to name all of them, you know all of them. Um, just checking to make sure. Pretty much everybody is just close to level 3. Uh, we should be fine. We should definitely be fine. We have the better healer, so... Yeah. Jeez, is that all? Yeah, I guess it is. One, two, four, six, eight, nine. Only nine things to kill. Mostly flyers, clearly. These two I think we were seeing before, yeah. These we saw before, maybe not you. Bishop, no, we had not seen you before. Okay, Bishop has heal 3. Because these things have a lot of HP, so they need a bigger heal spell than heal 1. Like the other thing, yeah. 33 attack is, I have no clue, pretty decently high. Pretty decently scary, I think. Yeah, kind of. It would do like 10 damage to people that are getting close to 30. And then you have bow, double blaze, too. Just cause. 35 attack is pretty high too. I'd rather he use blaze, to be honest. As long as he only hits one person. He can only cast blaze to once, by the way. Uh, defense 20, HP 36, that should be fine. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2. His range is this. I could use slate actually pull him over here. I could and I will. Except he does not want to get over here, so I'm gonna pull Slade back because... Slade's in danger right now. Not too much to say about this, I mean, we got half a force, and I guess they have half an army as well. They are very considerate like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. Whoa, I lost it. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. Except you can't get this far, but that's basically his range. Ah, uh, yeah, you stay out of this. How close are these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. They won't be in range. Yeah, well, you know what? Just stay there. That thing is really annoying now. God. Seriously? Get over here and do something. 
like it's afraid of us or something. Or maybe we're supposed to kill the things on the left first, but I don't want to. You're right there. <sighs> well, I'll have to deal with the other things first. Is Chester about to take his turn, or did he just take it? I think he just took his turn. Yeah, okay, this thing does not want to come over here. That's really aggravating. What's your defense? 20. As opposed to everyone's very close other defense. I'd rather somebody else tank, to be honest. Chester! Exactly the person I wanted. Huh, these things are 30%, that's interesting. I don't see how it offers more cover, but I guess it does. Hmm. Alright, just gotta wait for them to actually come in. You only have six movement. Oh. So, so the bat's not gonna make it. Well. Not to worry, I can deal with that. the bat. Rat fly, sorry. These are rats more than they are bats, apparently. And I would agree with that, because these bat things don't look anything like bats. Ha! He's actually somewhat decent at attack. That's amusing. You're not... yet. Um... I don't think you can kill anything either, which is really lame. I mean, you could if you use the big old freeze three, but sounds a little wasteful. Please get six experience. Nine, that's good. Good enough. MP2, attack one. She's being kind of lame on her level ups. I don't remember when she starts getting her attack then. Thank you for being dumb. I, I love when the enemy gets dumb. That's a lot of damage, though. Oh. Oh, hello. Ow. Things are getting dangerous now. Very dangerous, because I got a couple people really close to dying. Um... Slade is in danger, because if the rat fly... If the rat fly takes a turn, the rat fly can finish off Slade. Playing this really badly. Okay, kill this because it's going to kill Slade. Thank you. What? 48 experience? How? This is the oldest enemy in the entire map here. The hell? Get off the easier percent, you, by the way. It's gonna help you not die. Three as well. That's a really good level up. May, you should look at that level up and, you know, learn something. Chester is the only one at level two. Fantastic. Give him a kill and move on. Three. HP 2, defense 3. No attack. It's okay. He's got a lot of, ta of attack from that new weapon of his. Lots of flyers up there. <gasps> oh, no. Sorry. Hmm. It is in the morning. So I will yawn a little. Guess I'm not completely woken up yet. Hmm. Well, I should take it a little slower because Jaha is still wounded, so I have some more healing to do, you know. I'm guessing I'm not gonna get that many level ups off of this because uh, there aren't that many enemies. I mean, there's not very many of us either, but still. They gotta be getting close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. Oh. That close, huh? Well. 
Well, now they're in range. So, there goes that. Okay, you're gonna be there, and you're gonna get healed by Slade. Excellent. Now I only need to wait for the Pegasi to actually come in. They should say, they should they wait for them to get involved. Oh, the mage getting involved would be terrible in the position I'm in currently. Oh wow, I put May in range of that? That's horrible. At least he didn't go for it. Still, should not have done that. Um, you're probably gonna die if I send you in there because too much stuff with too much attack is up there. I don't like this. Back enough. Yeah, definitely back enough. Yeah, because Pegasi are too close to everything else. I don't like that. And the three and the thirty percent is too much for them. Okay, I was just verifying that he does not have um, that he does not have uh, Bolt. Now Chester can actually attack while uh, doing a tactical retreat, so he'll be fine attacking that. I think May is still in range of the other one though. Hmm. Stop happens. It's actually tempting to do that, but no, I just backed off for a reason. That reason is these things are gonna kill us because we were too close. Oh, I guess the mage would have been shy. Hmm. Worried. I was worried for nothing. And why? I bugged his AI. Jeez. Yeah, I'm gonna heal Diana here. May can actually kill that thing, so I'm gonna let her do that. Jerk! Okay. What? I pressed left! God! I am angry. Angry. You stay there, you do nothing. That other one was supposed to be dead now. Really? I pressed left. It's funny how sometimes the game just does not register my button presses. I don't like that. Yeah, keep doing that, that's fine. Yay. Guess you're dealing with the Radfly. Damn. And dealing you are. Jeez, you are strong. Ooh, well, May's got a new mission now. Ha ha ha. Oh yeah. So you're low in experience, right? No, you're not. Hmm. Eric is. Fine, that's gonna be Eric's kill. Which means I don't do Jack here. Because May's already going to get a kill off of freezing all three of that pack. So I don't want her to get more than one kill, so I can't attack anything. Which is kind of lame, but whatever. It's worth it just for the sake of hitting three things. Because hitting three things is fun. You. If I equip you with this, you have 28. Is 28 enough to kill you? Theory, it should be. I don't trust the game with it, but I'll... Yeah, I don't trust the game with it. 
Just because there's probably going to be some variation that's going to make it 7 instead of 8. Dumb as it is. Alright then, free survey. Because fun. That's all there is to it. That's actually a waste of experience. But fun. That's all I have to say. Because she would have had 49 even without hitting the other two things. So that is a giant waste of experience. I don't much care. Yeah, whatever. I could protect Slade by putting Chester closer, but then he'd have to kill the other one and blah. Somebody's going to take a turn. I'd like to give the other Pegasi to Jaha, actually. If at all possible. Because as I remember, Jaha is low. Yeah, it kind of is. So we'll get him all fixed up. Oh, mage, no. Well, that... that's okay. <laughs> Very okay. Not a not a problem whatsoever. Now I need to spread out because Blaze Three is coming. Now that's something else. Well, you stay close, but that's just because you heal from close. It's the melees that are going to be moving up in half a second that need to spread out. Tempting? I'll leave you here, though. Um, wish you could be closer. But this is... yeah. Oh, Mage did not come in. Fine, be that way. We're gonna have to get a whole lot closer. Before they're even gonna look at us. It's alright. Tempting. Really tempting. Although he's all alone up there, and that's really dangerous for him, actually. It's okay, though, he'll be fine. I think. Because the bishop would heal the mage instead of attacking, which means the mage is only a thing to attack, and it's not enough to kill him. There we go. If the mage gets to attack. No! Okay, so the bishop's going to be the only thing attacking him. It's not enough to kill something, so... Yeah. Should be fine. That was a great level up. Oh dear. Wonder if... Uh... Yeah. I wonder if... Slade is in range to heal that. Yes, just barely. Excellent. Go Slade! He was actually level 4 before anyone else. Well, he's a healer. They do tend to get a little more experience in my uh, experience with these games. I'm gonna put him there so that Slade can have a piece of the action if he gets a turn. These things have a surprising defense. I'll give him that. You know what? This is the end of the game. The battle. Not the game. Ha! <laughs> nowhere, no, nowhere clear. So, uh, yeah, gonna spend the rest of my mana. That's what I meant. Don't think that's gonna kill it. Yeah, definitely not. I don't think it would have killed him even if I had hit. It's also not gonna kill him. That means Jaha gets the kill. Well, whatever. HP 2, defense 3. More tankiness. Because he did not have enough already. And then you get the kill. Do you think he levels up after of that? Once he finishes picking up an herb. HP 3, attack 1, defense 2. Pretty good. So we beheaded the trap or something. Hey, you look fun. 
Here! I've caught up to you at last! I was ordered to follow them! You must be Claude! Randolph must have sent you! Um, must be Claude? Mayfair, Claude was your companion last book. You should be able to recognize him, as well as Randolph. Is the group in Portobello okay? Don't worry, but now they're on their way to I am. Let's also head for I am. I'll accompany you. Um, we can't decide where we're headed, by the way. Just thought I'd tell you about it, you know. So Claude, the bird battler, has joined the Shining Force. Now Claude... <sighs> Fortunately, they're headed in the right direction. We'll land at the port of Damis. Then we'll head for Arkham Ford. Sounds like a plan. Doesn't it just? Hey, we get camp now. To talk uh, about Claude, rather be briefly, because I talked a lot about him last book. Uh, I did mention last book that he was the best bird in the entire franchise, basically. And that's true. In this book, he has a lot of attack, decent uh, defense, decent enough to actually take a hit or something, which is uh, better than most books in most, not most books, but most birds in the Shining Force history. However, this is on a difficulty that has more attack than I'm used to, so maybe that's not even true anymore, but still. He has a lot of attack, uh, good enough defense to take a hit, and he's also the only flyer you get in the entire book. And that used to be a game uh, before it became Giant Force CD. So, yeah, he you have no reason not to use Claude. The only flyer, and he's really good, no reason not to use him. So I'm just going to check out what the shops have real quick. That looks like new stuff. I'll be doing some purchases for some people, and then I'll see y'all next time when we uh, arrive at the port of Dennis or whatever, or when we decide to check out what the other group's doing. I don't know. We're probably going to stick with this group since the intermission is with this group, though. So uh, until then, see y'all.